remotely fly your kite from anywhere. Let's have a look at generating clean green energy from the wind using kites. There are two methods being explored, pumping cycles and the carousel. Pumping cycles, the kite is typically flown in a figure eight pattern, pulling the reel cable out and generating power. The kite is then retracted using less power. A single cable to the ground is used and an airborne actuator system is attached to the four kite lines and remotely controlled from the ground. The carousel kite or kites pull the horizontal reel around so that power is generated all of the time. The control of multiple kites will be more complex than a simple kite pumping cycle. This demo is orientated towards the carousel system. In order to achieve autonomous kite control, the robot has to learn how to fly a kite. Using a Kinect sensor to capture the 3D pole positions of an expert flying a kite, multiple patterns can be stored in a database. The autonomous robot can then retrieve a pattern and replay it. In the demo setup, two winches are used for the left kite pole. The first video shows the speed of the synchronised winches being determined by the angle between the top and bottom of the pole. A vertical pole is the stationary position. The chart shows the kite pole position inputs at the top and the winch outputs at the bottom in real time. In the next video, the winches mirror the actions of the kite flyer. The pattern is stored and replayed autonomously by the robot. That pattern has automatically been stored in the database, so we can now ask the robot to replay it by itself.
Developing an autonomous robot into an intelligent robot requires that the robot replays a pattern and monitors the power generated. Then the robot modifies the pattern and continues replaying it and improving the performance.